Welcome everyone, so happy to be here today. I'm so excited. I'm JC Burge from WPLG Channel 10. I'm your co-host today. This is the third annual Wine, Women and Shoes, that's why I'm here. It is presented by Public Supermarket Charities. And I'm Elena Capra. I am also the host of SoFlo Home Project on WPLG. And we are really excited to be your co-host today and to get this all underway. I know, there's so much fun stuff. This is the Wine, Women and Shoes Committee that put together an incredible one hour show and we are going to be here presenting it to you today. I hope you're out there with your close girlfriends, your mom, of course it's Mother's Day weekend, maybe your daughters, your grandmother, everyone. The only thing I ask of you, grab a glass of wine, put on some fabulous shoes like we already have on and get ready for some major fun because we're just getting started. That's right. And of course, did you guys see this incredible charcuterie Ooh. board here? This is from Public Screenwise Market at the Main Las Olas in downtown Fort Lauderdale on Southeast 3rd Ave. They have generously donated this today and it looks so good. It's going to be hard not to eat that right now. <laughs> We're going to eat it. Don't you worry. We're going to eat it. And also, because of Publix making sure that we are here, we have so much other stuff we have to get to. We have a fashion show. It's hosted with members of the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. Also, quick reminder, 100% of all net proceeds we raise today goes directly to the 12,300 at-risk youth that they serve annually at a dozen locations in Broward County. So you are making a difference by being here with us right now. And we have to start things off with a special message, right? That's right. We have got a special message from Matt Organ, the co-CEO of the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. Coming up now. Welcome to the third annual Wine, Women and Shoes presented by Public Supermarket Charities benefiting the Boys and Girls Clubs of Broward County. Hello, I'm Matt Oregon, co-CEO for the Boys and Girls Clubs of Broward County. I'd like to give a special thank you to the Wine, Women and Shoes Committee, chaired by Raquel Case, Nicole Fraticangeli, Paula Friona, and Erica Moss, along with their committee members, Christine Tekeski, Mira Skoridin, Tracy Latame, Yvette Birdsong. And a huge thank you to all the sponsors who are making this event possible. And also a reminder, you can purchase your keys to the closet for $100 each. Now, that's over $25,000 in value in the closet. So please, please, please purchase your $100 um, as soon as you can. And you can do so by texting Broward 217277. And also use that same text to bid on your auction items. Give a gift from the heart for the Boys and Girls Club members. Together, we are all changing the lives of the youth that need us the most. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Matt. That was just beautiful. And we have to remind you, we would not be here and this event would not be taking place without all of our many sponsors. We already talked about Publix, Supermarket, Charities, presenting sponsor. They're amazing. Also, Ed Morris Automotive Group, our fashion show sponsor, of course, because of Erica. Erica. Love her fashion. <laughs> Always. Libert, our Mission Moment sponsor, City Furniture, which you know all about. I sure do. Our Keys to the Closet sponsor. And then there's a Frater Ken Jelly Wealth Management, which is our Marketplace sponsor. And of course, we have Rick Case Automotive. That is the Marketplace Ballet sponsor. TD Bank, the silent auction sponsor. We love a good silent auction. Oh. And of course, M. Austin and Christine Foreman, Holman Auto Group. That is our wine wall sponsor. I'm there for that. Yep. And then, of course, speaking of more wine, our wine tag sponsor is Erica Stowers Realtor. Nice. JEE Construction is here with us. Power Home Solar LLC, Lake Oil Company, Great Lakes Electronics, and Mind and Mobility. And of course, Mike Wilson, No H2O, New River Fine Art, Get Green and George Burkash. Let's not forget Lady Jane's Haircuts for Men, Jody and Ron Weiss, Jacqueline Scott team, that's with Remax, and we've got the Flower All Company in Miami. Lots and lots of great sponsors. And we also want to recognize and thank the Wine, Women and Shoes Committee, who without them, all this would not be possible. They worked really hard to ensure the success of this event. And we've got our co-chairs, Raquel Case, Nicole Bradicangeli, mm -hmm. Paula Friona, and Erica Morse. Oh, I love my, my Erica. Thank you so much to all of you. Along with our committee members, we're talking about Yvette Birdsong, Tracy Latomne, Mira Skorodin, Christine Tokeski, and a huge thank you to all of our sponsors, all of our committee members. You guys are making this possible and you're pretty amazing. That's right. And thank you to Publix again for being our presenting sponsor. The Women in Shoes Committee opted for a virtual event months ago, but they were really determined to make sure that this show was the best yet. But they also wanted their marketplace vendors to have the opportunity to sell those incredible goods 
to a select group of VIP ladies. I was there. On Saturday, April 8th, we had so much fun. About 150 of you shopped, you sipped wine, you had some little snacks. It was our marketplace pop-up event and it was sponsored by the Fred Arkin Jelly Wealth Management. And there were also eight marketplace vendors who donated and continue to donate a portion of their proceeds to the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. So shop this weekend and use the code BGCBC21 on the website provided and shop all weekend, it's for the kids. Love that, okay, that's, make sure you have that code. And right now, let's give you a little clip on that fun shopping day that we all loved. Hello everyone, Jeff Redder-Conjoli here, coming to you today to tell you a little bit about what got me and my family and my company involved in the Boys and Girls Club. I was introduced more intimately about 20 years ago from a good friend, Jason Lippert in Indiana. I got a taste for the Boys and Girls Club and all the people that have come together in that community to support that group. And it has been an ex experience that never left me. And since then, I've gotten involved in my hometown in Metro Detroit and as well as Broward County. And it is a program and it is a group that does all the right things for the right reasons. And I'm honored, and my family is honored, and my company is honored to continue to support. And I encourage everyone out there that hears this message to do the same thing. This is a program that changes lives. It disrupts for the better these young people that need it most. And they have our support, and I hope they have yours as well. I look forward to meeting you all. Bye for now. Matt Oregon here, co-CEO for the Boys and Girls Clubs of Broward County. I'd like to thank everybody for coming out here to the 2020-21 Wine, Women & Shoes event. Especially want to thank Nicole for allowing us to uh, use her beautiful home here for this uh, great day, for this great event. also want to thank our wonderful committee. Uh, what a great day we're going to have. There's a lot of vendors out here. I want to encourage everybody to come out here and do some shopping. And just as a reminder, 20% of all the proceeds are going, uh, of the vendors are going right back to the Boys and Girls Clubs. So come on out, let's do some shopping, have some fun, and change some lives. Thank you, everybody. It was so spectacular. I even brought my four-year-old son. We had a blast. Thank you guys for making it a memorable event. And who doesn't love shopping and fashion? And speaking of fashion, I had the opportunity to host the fashion show presented by Ed Morse Automotive Group at Bayview Cadillac. These six young ladies are members of the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County, and they have modeled some great looks, of course, with Vendors from our marketplace, their merchandise, so let's take a peek. We at the Ed Morse Automotive Group are proud to support this event for the third year in a row. I have seen firsthand how important events like these are to support the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. Every dollar we raise tonight goes directly to support the young men and women of the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. I encourage you to give, give big, give from your heart. So we can bring a little bit of what these boys and girls bring to us every single day. A little bit of love, a little bit of laughter, a lot of happiness, and a whole lot of hope. 
Thank you very much. Enjoy the third annual Wine, Women, and Shoes. And remember, you're always backed by Morse. Our 75th anniversary is still going strong, and there's no better time to join the over 1.75 million customers in county who are backed by Morse. You can be sure that every vehicle on our lot has the lowest price, guaranteed with our price protection promise. Welcome to the third annual Wine, Women and Shoes Fashion Show sponsored by Ed Morse Automotive Group. So we're here today at the showroom and we're going to have a look at some fabulous fashions modeled by members of the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. And remember at the end of the fashion show everything they're wearing is from the marketplace so you can shop these looks and more and a portion of the proceeds do go to the Boys and Girls Club. So first up is Samantha. She's a 17-year-old member wearing a Misa Lillian dress in a beautiful floral print, and that's from Jessie Boutique. She styles it with a crossbody bag in a snakeskin print from Alchemy by Shea, and accessorizes her look with a stack of studded bracelets from Carmen Soul from the Rinaldi store. We have Taraji. She is an 11-year-old member wearing Karina Grimaldi Rafa metallic mini dress in the beautiful color of tangerine from the Jessie Boutique. She's completing the look with a Daniela Ortiz crossbody bag with braided crossbody strap and tassel detail. And her bejeweled sandals are from Rinaldi. Next, we have Tarmisha, an 18-year-old member who's wearing Sunday's Chloe dress in the color black from the Jessie Boutique. She tops off the look with a beautiful aquamarine patent leather crossbody purse from Rinaldi, as well as coordinating aquamarine patent leather heels from Rinaldi as well. And then, of course, a beautiful gold necklace from Monisha Mawani. Next, we have Stephanie, a nine-year-old member, wearing the Love Shack Fancy Tala skirt in the color magenta paired with La Gent's Cory Crew Top in the color Rose Tan from the Jessie Boutique. The denim jacket is adorned with fashionable appliques and that is from Gorgeous Things. And her glitter sneakers are by Pamuk from Rinaldi. And she's topping off the look with a beautiful crossbody from Carmen Sol Rinaldi. Thank you so much, Stephanie. Next, we've got Maria, a nine-year-old member wearing the Chaser Ombre Bolts Pullover in tie-dye paired with the Chaser Ombre Bolts pants, completing the set both from Jessie Boutique. The animal print and glitter sneakers are by Pamuk from Rinaldi, and she's completing this look with a beautiful magenta Carmen Sol tote and a stack of bracelets from Love 13. Thank you so much, Maria. We have Dahlia here, a nine-year-old member, wearing the Chara Ruiz Greta skirt in white, and the Daydreamer Janice Joplin Freedom Hall Weekend Tee in tie-dye, both from Jessie Boutique. She tops off the ensemble with a bright yellow Carmen Soul purse, and of course, pink studded bracelets, also from Carmen Soul, both from Rinaldi. Here today. So, quick question for you right now. Have you had a chance to check out, it's my favorite portion, the silent auction? Well, we've got a lot of great stuff. We've got Chef Franco, a chef who often caters to South Florida's elite. He actually donated a fun package for the silent auction. He also did tasty bites at the marketplace and they were so delicious. Fancy. Also, my favorite as well, designer handbags. Woo! You've got to check that out. Along with just dozens of gift baskets. There's so much in the silent auction. So quick reminder, text Broward21, that's Broward21, to 72727. You got that? And you can sign up now for that just incredible silent auction. And make sure you check out the Instabuy button too, so you can kind of fast forward that for you. 
lots of great shopping and bids going to be happening there. And of course, that's where you'll find the Wine Wall presented by Home and Auto. For $25, you receive a bottle of wine and it can be valued up to $75. That is a great deal. And they're selling quick. Okay, we've got to put in our bids. Definitely. <laughs> and there's also <laughs> keys to the closet. Those are $100 each. The closet is presented by City Furniture, so you're going to see some of the incredible designer items valued at $25,000. The winner will be called, so you will find out by the end of this show. So please buy one or, or 10, you know, whatever <laughs> right now. Believe me, after watching this next video, you're going to want to buy one of those tickets. Hi, I'm Nicole Fratacangeli and I'm sitting here with Sabrina who is the Community Relations Manager at City Furniture. Sabrina, I was just wondering, what is it that City Furniture found in the Boys and Girls Clubs that they loved and embraced which made them want to be a part of it? Yeah, well I mean it's really important for us to be able to give back to our youth and really invest in their futures and investing in their future of course is investing in our future so, um, so we're really just you know, so proud to be a, a supporter of Boys and Girls Clubs and, and all that they do for the youth in Broward County. Um, and of course, our, our president, Andrew Koenig, is on the board. So, um, you know, that passion and dedication just really comes from the top down and, and we're really proud to be here. Absolutely. Well, I just want to say thank you so much, Sabrina, and to the entire group over at City Furniture. We're so proud to have you as a part of the help and support in the Boys and Girls Club and we look forward to the partnership in the future. Thank you. Yes. Hi, my name is Erica Morris. This is Paula Briona, Nicole Fratacangeli, and Raquel Case. We are the proud committee chairs for this year's third annual Wine, Women and Shoes auction. We're here at City Furniture. We'd like to thank them for being our closet sponsor. <laughs> They've also generously donated a $1,000 gift card in addition to all these amazing items. We are so excited to share some of these beautiful items in this closet behind us with you. There is so much here for women, for men. You really, really, really have to see all of it. It's hard to see, I know, probably from where you're looking, but um, there's stuff hidden back here in drawers and underneath here. It's unbelievable. There's luxury brands like Prada, Dolce & Gabbana, Balmain, Christian Louboutin, real gold and real diamond items in this closet, Christian Dior, and so many more. I am blown away by this closet, ladies. How about you, Paula? Amazing. And anyone can get involved. You can text Broward21 to 72727 to purchase your key to the closet for only $100. Winner takes all. You can also visit our Facebook page, the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County website, or you can call the club. Thank you for your support. Get your key today. And most importantly, why we are all here and why we have this amazing closet valued at over $25,000 to raffle off is to support the Boys and Girls Clubs of Broward County and our over 12,000 youth that we work hard to support every year to provide a better future. So ladies, I know what my favorite item is. Nicole, do you know what yours? I absolutely know what my favorite item is. I'm going right here to these beautiful Prada boots with a jeweled heel and gorgeous black leather. How about you, Raquel? I'm in on this beautifully studded Louboutin wallet mm. with, of course, the signature Red on the inside. Love this piece, yeah. Erica. Loving that. I would choose somebody else in my I would say the Dolce & Gabbana for tan Toto. Oh yeah, super cool. Love, love that. that. Yeah. <laughs> super cool for summer. And I am obsessed with this diamond and gold bracelet. It is stunning. All right, please don't forget, mm -hmm. go online, $100 a ticket, valued at over $25,000. And good luck, ladies. Thank you for, Thank your, support. You for your support. I love that closet. I'm definitely buying a ticket now myself. 
Oh, I don't blame you. Just beautiful. And in fact, since we're talking about beautiful, let's take another look at our models. So first up, we've got Maria, and she is wearing ombre tie-dyed sweats with a bolt print from Jessie Boutique. And she's pairing this colorful look with a bright yellow studded Carmen Sole purse from Rinaldi. Next up, we have Dahlia. She's wearing an Ed Morris baseball cap and pairing this casual look with a beautiful light pink studded Carmen Sole purse from Rinaldi. We have Stephanie, and she is wearing a hot pink studded Carmen Soul tote bag and the matching studded bracelets, both from Rinaldi. So Samantha is next and she is wearing a crossbody bag with embellished patches from Gorgeous Things. And she's paired it with a Monisha Mawani ring, as well as some bracelets from Carmen Soul from Rinaldi. We have Taraji and she is wearing an embellished denim jacket from Gorgeous Things paired with a beautiful belt bag from Alchemy by Shea and some studded earrings from Monisha Mawani and some spiritual bracelets from Love 13. This here's Youth of the Year and she is wearing an embellished military jacket from Gorgeous Things, pairing it with some layered gold necklaces from Monisha Mawani and topping off the look with a beautiful black studded purse from Carmen Soul from Rinaldi. And I just wanted to add that I am also wearing pieces from some of the Marketplace vendors. My bracelets are from Love 13 and the necklace from Monisha Mawani. Hi, my name is Paula Friona and I am proud to be co-chairing this event with such amazing women doing great things for our community here in Broward to help the kids who need it the most. I am passionate about these kids and I was a club kid in Niagara Falls, New York, and I still to this day remember my mentors, Miss Diane and Mr. Bradley, so it does have a lifelong effect. And I'm proud to support the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. Now at this time, let me tell you a little bit about the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. 55% members are male and 45% female. 45% of members' families earn less than $20,000 annually. Also, 66% of members live in a single parent head of household. That's 83% of our members that qualify for those free and reduced lunches. But here's the other part of that equation. You guys have to hear about this. These are really great numbers. 96% of members progress to the next grade level. 97% of senior members graduate from high school. And that means also that more than 7 million healthy snacks and meals have been served since 2011. So we're really creating pathways to success. And it's all through our college programs. Absolutely. Creating opportunities in the building industry and simply said, our workforce. Development programs are some of the strongest in the country amongst our Boys and Girls Club peers. But at this time, I would like to introduce to you all Tarmisha Charles, the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County's 2021 Youth of the Year, to join us back on the stage to tell us a little bit more about her story here at the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. And you may recognize her, right? Because she is one of our models, she is gorgeous, and this mission moment is brought to you by Lipper. On behalf of the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County, we would like to say a special thank you to our sponsor, Lippert.
I know you couldn't hear me. And that's because at a very young age, I lost my voice. Actually, no, it was taken from me, right along with my innocence. At the age of nine, I was left at home with someone I thought I could trust. And that person did the most imaginable thing that you could do to a nine-year-old girl. I tried to talk about it with family members, and they completely disregarded me. They made me feel as if I didn't matter and that I never even existed. And from that moment forward, I did not see the need to ever speak or be heard. My grades began to slip, self-esteem started to get lower, and I lost all hope. At the age of 16, I was introduced to the Boys and Girls Club. And honestly, I felt as if it was like any other day and that the things that happened when I was nine would happen when I was 16. But I kept the open mind and I went into the Boys and Girls Club. One day I went into the club and it was not one of my best days, but I faked a smile and I laughed everything off. I entered my car and I just was so tired. I started to cry. It's like I wanted everything to be over. I thought about taking my own life that day. But something told me to go back into the Boys and Girls Club. And I did. The staff there immediately pulled me to the side and told me, life is what you make it. Life has many obstacle courses, but it is up to you to make life what you want it to be. And it was at that moment I knew that I had to keep pushing, keep going. Standing here today reminds me of a quote my grandparents used to tell me. And it's basically saying a flower never grows where rain doesn't fall. And the Boys and Girls Club staff members helped me realize that the rain is only here to help me blossom into something wonderful. The Tarmisha that was nine and the Tarmisha that's 16 is way different from the Tarmisha that you see here today. Tarmisha is standing at a 4.0 grade point average, being the president of so many clubs like Keystone, Mentoring Tomorrow's Leaders, and so much more. I want to be the hope for the kids within our society today, the ones who feel voiceless, the ones who want to give up, I want to be the person that lets them know that the rain is not here to destroy you, but yet the rain is here to help you blossom into something beautiful. Thank you. Ah, how impressive was that? Absolutely. Oh, you guys are making a difference. You are changing and saving lives. This is an incredible impact on the Boys and Girls Clubs of Broward County, and it is changing our community. By the way, on your Qtego, there's a little click to give. I always ask everyone right now to go ahead and give right now. Give till it feels good. Wait, wait, no, no, no. Give till it feels great. That's right, and don't forget the silent auction closes on Tuesday, Ooh. May 11th at noon. And a special thank you to TD Bank for their silent auction sponsorship. It's all Shop possible. now. Yes. Shop now. Shop now. This is the time. Bid high and bid often because it's all for the kids. Mm -hmm. And we do have a special message right now from a family who's involved in every event that Boys and Girls Club of Broward County has. The Case family has been involved for more than 35 years. And the BGCBC is so grateful for their enthusiasm and their dedication to change so many lives right here in our community. We believe that providing a positive, educational environment for our youth is the key to their future. Providing the tools to help them decide what their true professional passion is in life gives them an opportunity of achieving career success while enjoying hard work. 
Rick and I have been dedicated to the mission of the Boys and Girls Club for the past 35 years to provide a positive place for kids and support their educational growth. As a family, we're dedicated to the future success of the Boys and Girls Clubs of Broward County. Hello, my name is Jennifer Starkey. I'm Regional Vice President for TD Bank, America's Most Convenient Bank. Welcome to the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County's third annual Wine, Women and Shoes event. It is our mission at TD Bank to enrich the lives of our customers, colleagues, and community. With partnerships with not-for-profit organizations like the Boys and Girls Club of Broward, our impact in the community is limitless. Together, we can build a more inclusive community where all can succeed. TD Bank is proud to be the silent auction sponsor for today's event. So join me, you influencers, tastemakers, and connectors, and open your handbags and your hearts to support the continued mission of the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. Thank you, I hope you all enjoyed today's event and stay well. Oh my gosh, can you believe it is final call for keys to the closet purchases? This is your last chance. Go into that cute tago, look at Instabuy, 100 bucks each. Wow, and right now though, we have a final message from the co-CEO, Chris Gentilly. Hi, I'm Chris Gentilly, co-CEO with Boys and Girls Club of Broward County. We hope you enjoyed the third annual Boys and Girls Club of Broward County Wine, Women and Shoes event. Thank you so much for what you do and thank you for believing in our mission and our kids. And more importantly, thank you for helping us do whatever it takes to continue shaping futures. See you next year. All right, everyone, it is time to announce our winner. So yeah. a little drum roll. Arrrr. See the raffle behind us? That's right. And now. The winner of the City Furniture Key to the Closet is... And now for our live drawing of the Key to the Closet raffle. My name is Thais Romero. I'm an alumni and I also work for the Boys and Girls Club of Broward County now. And now, drum roll please, winner. Let me spin a little bit. And the winner is... Jamie McDonald, wow!